feel too bad, Sam. There's only five things in all of creation that that gun can't kill, and I just happen to be one of them. But if you give me a minute, I'm almost done. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't suppose you just say yes right here and now, end this whole tiresome discussion. That's crazy, right? It's never gonna happen. Oh, I don't know, Sam. I think it will. I think it'll happen soon, within six months. And I think it'll happen in Detroit. You listen to me, you son of a bitch. I'm gonna kill you myself. You understand me? I'm going to rip your heart out. That's good, Sam. You keep fanning that fire in your belly. All that pent-up rage, I'm gonna need it. What did you do? What did you do to this town? Oh, I was very generous with this town. One demon for every able-bodied man. And the rest of them? In there. I know, it's awful, but these horsemen are so demanding. So it was women and children first. I know what you must think of me, Sam. But I have to do this. I have to. You of all people should understand. What's that supposed to mean? I was a son. A brother like you. A younger brother. And I had an older brother who I loved. Idolized, in fact. And one day I went to him and I begged him to stand with me. And Michael... Michael turned on me. Called me a freak. A monster. And then he beat me down. All because I was different. Because I had a mind of my own. Tell me something, Sam. Any of this sound familiar? Anyway, you'll have to excuse me. Midnight is calling, and I have a ritual to finish. Don't go anywhere. Not that you could if you would. Tora zo du zo da mona. Now repeat after me. We offer up our lives, blood, soul. We offer up our lives, blood, souls. To complete this tribute. To complete this tribute. Just demons. <laughs>